Welcome to Clarion University. I'm Britt Seahall. I'm a sophomore broadcasting major here at the university, and I'll be your tour guide for today. After walking through the front gates of our esteemed university, you've landed here, outside Founders Hall. Founders is where you'll find classes in poli-sci, history, and anthropology, as well as a handful of others. In fact, many of the artifacts that are displayed in Founders were actually dug up by Clarion professors and students alike. That was just a quick overview of all that Founders has to offer. Now let's get moving on to the academic quad. Here we are in the heart of the academic quad. Behind me is the Carlton Library, which is home to, well, books and lots of them. On top of having an extensive collection of volumes, the Carlson Library features Mac Labs, PC Labs, and even a full service cafe. Okay, now we're going to move to the center of campus where we'll take a look at more of our academic buildings. Here we are surrounded by some of the main academic buildings here on campus. Behind me, Davis, which is home to the Department of English and Foreign Languages. To my left is Stevens Hall, which houses our departments in education and special education. And if you walk down the path to my right, you will find Harvey Hall, which is home to our majors in psychology and sociology. One thing I do want to mention though, across campus we have Still, which is the home to our business majors. Earlier in the tour, we got a chance to look at Founders Hall, which is one of the oldest buildings here on campus. Now I want to take a look at one of the newer additions to Clarion, the Science and Technology Center, or the STC as we call it here on campus. The STC is home to our expansive science department, and you will find within it laboratory classrooms, lecture halls, and even a planetarium. Students attending classes here in the STC will get a hands-on experience in an eco-friendly building where labs outnumber the classes. I actually have a class right now, but I'm going to leave you guys in the capable hands of our next tour guide who will take it on from here. Hi, how you doing today? My name is Maurice Zings, and we're standing outside the Marwood Boy Fine Arts Center home of our two theaters. One, auditorium style, where we have events like show choir and musical choir. The second one we have, the Black Box Theater. Here we have two great productions each semester. Also in the Marwood Boy Fine Arts Center, we have our art department. You can even walk down the hallways and see great artwork that our students created. Across the street from Marwick Boy is Becker Hall. This building houses our communication and computer science departments. Here, we have numerous computer labs. We also have a TV station and radio station where you can even become a part of the news crew or you can host your own show. Across the lawn from Boyd and Becker, we have the Student Recreation Center. Here we have a track, a weight room, aerobic center, three courts, and we also have a rock wall. The rec also houses 50 intramurals and club sports. Clarion University also offers 14 NCAA Division II men's and women's sports, as well as a Division I wrestling program. A few feet from the rec center is the Gimmel Student Complex, which is our main hangout on campus. Upstairs we have the multi-purpose room, which holds numerous events throughout the week and on the weekend. Some of these events are planned by our university's activity board. If you're interested in event planning or just being a part of what's going on campus, UAB is definitely the place for you. Downstairs in Gimu, we have the Book Center, where you can pick up all your Golden Eagle gear. Walk down the hallway and you'll find our Gimu Food Court. Here's where students eat, relax, and study together between classes. All right, guys, all this touring has made me hungry. So I'm about to go in here and grab a bite to eat. But I'll leave you with our next tour guide, who will show you the rest of campus. Hi there. My name is Kiri and I'm a sophomore music education major here at Clarion University, so I'll be taking you through the last stretch of your tour. Right now, we're standing outside the Keeling Health Center, which is our on-campus health clinic. So if you're ever feeling ill, broke a limb or something, you can come here, have it checked out, and they'll send you on your way. This also houses our nationally accredited speech pathology program, as well as a functional speech and hearing clinic that is available to the local community. So that was a quick overview of our Keeling Health Center. Right now we're going to head over to the suites and see some residence halls. So for a lot of you, this is probably going to be your first experience away from home. So we have a couple different housing options for you. Right now we're standing in front of Valley View Suites. 
In the suites, you have the option of two people or four people. So basically, you'll have two bedrooms with two people and a common living area. Each bedroom has its own bathroom, so you'll only have to share your bathroom with one other person. We also have a more traditional style of housing on campus. In here, you'll only have one roommate and a common lobby area for your entire floor. Living in the traditional dorms is a great way to meet a lot of people and make a lot of friends. Our third style of housing, Reinhard Villages, is about a minute down the street from the main part of campus. In here, you'll have your own bedroom with utilities for laundry and a full kitchen. That was a quick overview of our living options on campus, so now we'll go talk about our dining options. We've already talked about the Gemma Food Court and a couple cafes on campus, but right now we're standing outside of Clarion's main dining hall, the Eagle Commons. Inside, it's buffet-style eating with everything from a salad bar to an Italian bar, Mediterranean, home-style, and an ever-changing dessert bar. Along with the dining hall, we have our very own Starbucks in this building. Well, that's all for our quick virtual tour. We hope you enjoyed it. If you have any other questions or you'd like to schedule a real tour, feel free to call admissions or browse around the website for more information. On behalf of Clarion University, we hope to see you soon and have a great day.